Guns and tech rolled up in a package. Yours for more than 27 grand. That's what Austin, Texas-based startup Tracking Point is selling. This is the most advanced shooting system in the world in that it can, within minutes, a untrained user can be able to hit shots out to 1,000 yards, 1,200 yards using this technology. Wait, really? In addition, we have a Wi-Fi server embedded in this scope that allows a shooter to be able to stream video out of the scope, download the recorded videos of every shot sequence he's taken. Let's back up a minute. First, shooting at distances over a few hundred yards is hard. That's why the military spends years training its snipers. It's heavy on the calculations and takes a keen eye to recognize specifics in the environment. That's what Tracking Point CEO Jason Schauble, a former Marine, wants to change. Why people miss at long range? They miss because they misestimate range or they miss because of the, they don't understand the environmental impacts, whether it be temperature or pressure or even the small nickel and dime things like spin drift that are, affect the shot at long range. And they also miss because they jerk the trigger. So we decided to address all three of those things. A normal trigger would just have all the metal pieces and try to take a lot of that error out. So this is what a scope looks like on the inside. This scope, which Tracking Point integrates with specific rifles, allows you to set your target by pressing a button, Perfect. just like that. Perfect it uses an algorithm to calculate where you need to aim. The trigger has built-in electronics, so even though it's pulled here when the X turns red, the gun only fires when your crosshairs hit your bullseye. Nice. Good form. Wow. Really good form, man. Wow. That was a shot at 252 yards. This is a finished consumer product. This isn't an idea. This isn't a, a funded prototype. Tracking Point says they will sell about 500 this year and a few thousand next year. The demand is overwhelming. And according to both Tracking Point and independent analysts, the military has not publicly acknowledged having anything like this. The U.S. military has 12,000 sniper rifles. The U.S. military has in, in excess of one and a half million service rifles. The first reaction we got from the U.S. Army was, well, wait a minute, this was in our roadmap in 2020. I can have a guy with an iPad who can see the, the camera view from the heads-up display of everybody else in his squad. So how easy is it, really? The guys at Tracking Point say they've got a smart scope that does most of the work. We're at a shooting range in Liberty Hill, Texas, and I'm going to try and hit a target that's 1,000 yards away. That's 10 football fields. It's a long, it's a long way down there. If we're streaming now, you can see... If I lift the gun up, you can see what we're seeing right there. I want you to find uh, the 250-yard mark. My hands aren't nearly as steady as I thought they would be. Is that 1,000? That, that's 1,000. That's now, now, I want you to shoot the target. That's They're on right the there. far left. Good tag. Solid tag. All right. Let her rip. Squeeze and hold. Move it into the... Three hits. The tracking point guys judge the wind for me. The technology to call wind speeds isn't there just yet, but the scope did the rest. I had never shot at anything that far away, and uh, I don't think it would be possible without using a scope like this. But it made us think, if I could hit the target so easily, who else might want to use a technology like this? It basically turns your average Joe into a sniper, and some people might want to do more than shoot wildlife. Well done. The Department of Homeland Security would not comment on concerns about this technology falling into the wrong hands. Neither would the Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, Firearms and Explosives because they don't regulate scopes, just guns. While anybody buying this gun knew would have to clear a background check, after the initial sale, under federal law, the gun owner can legally sell this technology to anybody without regulation or record. Nice. Aaron Smith, CNN Money. Austin, Texas.